My name is Dalen. I'm enrolled with the Shoshone Paiute tribes in Doug Valley. It's on the Idaho-Nevada border, um, south of Mount Home, north of Elko, right on the border, middle of nowhere. I've lived in a on the reservation for all my life, only leaving to Reno for summers, three months at a time, and occasionally leaving for work on the summers, but I lived here my whole life so far. The Doug Valley Indian Reservation was established on April 16th, 1877, from the executive order of Rutherford Ford B. Hayes, seven years after Captain Sam put in a request for this land. And it can be taken away by another president because it was an executive order from the prior president. From what my teacher told me was, the settlers used the Manifest Destiny as a way to justify moving westward and installing reservations and moving Indians off their land into the reservations. They justified it, they manifest destiny, along with the islanders too, from Hawaii to the American Samoas. It's definitely in the earlier days when they first established the reservation, relied on commodities from the government and we couldn't leave the boundaries of the reservation. Two of the most popular ways people know about Indians is through TV and dead Indians. They base it off of past things like teepees, and we don't live in teepees still. And Indians on TV, like Dances with Wolves, that's inaccurate. When, say, like people wear headdresses, like for schools, they wear a headdress, a celebrity wears a headdress for like a video. That's the equivalent of stolen valor, of wearing, say, the Purple Heart or a silver medal given to you by the government for combat. I'm working for the Shopai Fire Crew here in Hawaii, Nevada. I am a wildland type two firefighter right now. And we go out, dig line, try to corral the fire into controlling what we want it to do for it to be extinguished. I plan on attending the University of Idaho in Moscow and the major I'll be studying in is fire ecology and management under the natural resource department. Hobbies and activities that I enjoy. Well, for the past week and a half, I've been coming to the gym at around three or six-ish, playing basketball for warm up and working out either my legs, back, upper body, wherever. Then when I'm not doing that, usually my days just filled up doing my fire courses and finishing my college stuff that's required for me to get into college. Um, along with just watching movies, a lot of movies, and binging TV shows. What I see myself as, or what I hope to see myself as, or be, is financially stable, mm, happy, off and on, because that just doesn't stay as happiness. And, I just hope to be in a good place and happy with what I've done in the past.